you know where you are? This is Nollywood Pictures to you. Be a traditional man. Evu ali agugu. Hey! Be bad and Hey! You must achieve. Even Cabo Guananu, even Cabo Guananu, as I wanna be going with the women, even Cabo Guananu, even Cabo Guananu, even Cabo Guananu, we do it for what I knew. Say, 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 Convert our town to Arabanko village, to Makosa village. You know, 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 you you plan you assassin My child, you know, 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 you you know, you they don't join you. In my way, fed in Lukuna, those who can be done. In my way, fed in Lukuna, those who can be done. In my way, fed in Lukuna, those who can be done. In my way, fed in Lukuna, those who can be done. In my way, fed in Lukuna, those who can be done. In my way, fed in Lukuna, those who can be done. In my way, fed in Lukuna, those who Shut up! Shut up! You're no longer in Congo. This you are in Nigeria, our hometown. In fact, this is our village, Obofia. Sorry, my dear. Please, we are looking for the eight years on our family in Obofia village here. You mean uh, eight years on the famous madman? Exactly. More. We, we, we. Actually, you have missed your way. Yeah. Okay. Go through this uh, on tide road now, eh? Uh -huh. eh? Then come out to the next tide road, uh -huh. eh? Follow your left. Uh -huh. The third building by the same left, eh? That's the house you're looking for. Oh, oui, oui, oui. Merci beaucoup. <clears throat> I don't know any family called Merci beaucoup in this community. Sorry, I need mean to say thank you very much. You're welcome, you're welcome. Driver, let's go. Look, madam. I'm not moving an inch here. Okay, well, what is it? Did you pay me to drive it to the end of this world? See, you will require a bulldozer to move me from this place. I'm not going to Niger. Driver, qu'est-ce que c'est? Qu'est-ce que c'est, ce code? Qu'est-ce que c'est, ce code? Oh, let's get that book. Driver. Oh, and driver, come to us. Oh, so what, what, what is it? Come to us, so quick. Come to us, so quick. Oh, driver. Come to us. 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 I'm 
land has welcomed massive danger. Does not live here. No, 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 no. That simply means good day. Ah, oh. I greet you Great. too. Hold on. Thank you. And please, is this H's on our family's compound? Yes. Uh, I hope no problem. Oh, sweet home. Oh, oh sweet home. <laughs> oh, um, sorry. My name is. Sabina Echizona. I traveled with my uncle Unanna to Congo 30 years ago when I was 11 years. Sabi, as large as life. Don't tell me you are Wakego, my sister. I am Wakego. Sabina, my sister. Wakego. Sabina. Wake. Sabina. <laughs> Who is she? <laughs> My daughter, of course. Your daughter? Oh, yeah. You will not have a good daughter like this. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. You're welcome. Master. Hey, hey, what is your name? Oh, so my first is here. Yeah. She doesn't understand English. No, she understands English. Her name is Isioma. They call her Fetenyon in Congo. Yeah, Isioma is okay. Like that one. Mama, you are welcome, my daughter. Mm. You are welcome. You are welcome. Mama, don't like it. You're my own one. Don't worry. Don't worry. You will like yeah. it. By the time I start calling and calling and calling you that name, you will like it. Yeah. Yeah. You will like it. Yeah. 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 
<laughs> You're welcome. You know, the whole village has been speculating on how our marriage is going to look like. Uh, the ceremony is going to be something that um, that no one can guess. Eh? And uh, <laughs> it's going to be bigger than what any mind can imagine. Yes. <laughs> you know, you always sweep me off my feet every other day that I see you. Yeah, and I love you too. I love you more. No, I should be the one saying it and not you. I will love you forever and ever and ever. And I will love you forever. <laughs> what is it? This is a sign that my mother calls me. It's urgent. And I need to leave now. Sometimes something will show, sometimes not. Just go. Omen Konyenka! You they give you a holla for this villa. You be balaba. Omenka! For this villa, you be a holla. Omenka! You they give you a holla for this villa. You be balaba. Omenka. For this villa, you be a holla. Omenka. Hmm. We have not reached any business deal, and you are here suffocating my bench. Ah. Omenka, you should at least uh, answer our greetings first now, okay? Keep your greetings, keep your greetings. And uh, let my bench have some fresh air. I don't trust you, your, your, this thing you are depositing in my, on my bench. Omenka, are you asking us to get up? Is that what you are saying? You have just said exactly what I said. You are repeating it. Eh? Ichomenka, have you forgotten that we are your son's clients? Have you forgotten? Have you forgotten that the money with which you built this your house, bought this chair, this bench, and even the mouth organ that blows your pride? We paid your son the money. He got it from us. Thank Have you, you forgotten? Thank, thank you very much. Thank eh? you very much. Hmm? Thank you very much. Now, who is begging who? Is it my son that he went to your houses to, to seek your, your, your patronage? Or that you came to my house here to ask for my son's services? Eh? Which is which? Tell me. Omega. When will you stop being hostile to people? When will you stop this unholy pride? Ah. As long as Olisa, my son, is the most talented farmer in this whole in this whole community, and the only pride of Obofia Kingdom. Hmm? Yes. Now get up, get up, get up, and tell me why you are here. Get up for the bench. Get up, oh. get up, and tell me why you are here. Omenka, if I didn't come here with a grateful heart, there's no way, not even a second, would I have condoned your attitude, the arrogance you spat on my face and my fellow elders. Hello. Omenka, we need an apology. Bye. Now that I have let it out, I call no an idea. Omenka, your son worked hard for me. I had a bountiful harvest. And I said to myself that 
I will be a foolish elder if I wouldn't show appreciation to his hard work. Here are my gift of thanksgiving to your son from my farm of which he cultivated. You said my son cultivated your farm, hmm? And you had bountiful harvest. Yes, sir. And you come to present this kwashoko gift as your gratitude. Hey! Onowa, you are as sick as your gratitude. Uh, it's your mentor. He called it gratitude. After all, he paid your son. He's not owing your son at all. He's not owing your son at all. He just gratitude. If this bench were not truly mine, huh? Eh? Or if this bench is mine, and you sit on it for the next five seconds, may Amadioha elongate your manhood longer than your two legs joined together. Okay, the bunker. We came to your house to employ the services of your son. Mm -hmm. And all we get is these terrible curses on us. <laughs> you all did the right thing. Hmm? For your information, I, as the manager of my son, hereby increase his wages of his job to 20,000 naira per job. 20,000 what? 20,000 20, naira. 1,000 naira. Uh, what is wrong with the 10,000 naira we usually pay? Eh? What Make is wrong with that? Oh, oh. The manager has spoken. The manager yeah. has spoken. I have spoken. Look at I won't get at our The land is beset with gross evil. There is danger! in the air you must be fortified against the attack mother i'm fortified already am i not the danger i perceive is so huge so huge that our land has never seen before i don't want my daughter to be a victim of such disaster Mother, you have endowed me with so much powers to conquer every evil that comes my way. Not one more word again. On your knees. On your knees! Face up by me. Whatever that wants to kill you shall see this foul in place of you. Any horror oh, that is to attack you shall attack this foul. Anything that wants to hit you shall see this foul. Oh, Okwani <laughs> When our mother and the rest of our siblings died, and Papa's madness proved beyond cure, I decided to spend the rest of my life in Congo. I couldn't withstand the shame of coming back home and being called the daughter of a madman. 
I got married to the most popular Makosa dancer in Congo and bore him Sesion. I mean Isioma. I joined my husband in his Makosa dance. I gave birth to Isioma on Makosa dance floor. Her father dedicated her to Makosa dance. That is all she knows how to do. But unfortunately, unfortunately, he died last month. Oh God. That's why we decided to find our way back home. Oh my God. It's okay, it's okay. <laughs> It's okay, stop the tears. Whatever that has happened is past. Hmm. And the reason why we are alive is to face the future. It's okay. It's okay. May his soul rest in peace, Yon. Amen. So, Auntie Yon, what about your husband, Yon, and your children, Kwano? Hmm. My daughter, I have none. Nobody wants to marry someone with madness in their lineage. Oh. Especially madness inflicted by the traditions of the land. Your mother was lucky. She went far away. That was why she was able to have you. Hmm. Okay. Yeah. The call. Hmm. I understand you. Sabina, what is all this uh, Zion, Zion, Kwanon she always adds at the end of each word she says? It's called Ghetto Lumpala. Yeah, we, we, Ghetto Lumpala, you Yeah. Mm. What is it? It's your mother. You have to stop that now. You're no longer in Congo. Uh -huh. We're in the village. Mama, I will try on. You better. So tell me, where was Papa buried? My sister Sabina. Mm. According to the traditions of our land, it is a taboo to bury him in our village. Oh. They disposed his corpse into Udenewu River. I am back. I am back with a mission and revenge. The whole village must pay the very hard way. Mama, there is no going back on this mission. Mwaka! Mwaka! Bonjour. Bonjour, monsieur. Uh, Mba. Uh, Bonnie and Uju just left for the city yesterday. Kesskesse. Ma, don't you have respect? Do I look like a woman that wears skirt? Don't you know that you have to first greet an elder before you begin to ask questions about Bonnie and Uju and how uh, cool their skirt is? Eh? But I greeted you. Go and quickly call Mwaka for me. Ah, so, Sabina, it is true. Uh -huh. So you could find your way back home. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey. Thank you very much. Sabina, you are welcome. Thank you very much. You are You're welcome. welcome, sir. You have to teach her how to greet others. Oh, Sision, greet Marzi. Ma, I greeted, but he didn't respond. Come on. 
Bonjour, monsieur. Ah, Bikoné, ça y a soi, il y a un nom libre. C'est si on sait. Au tout au ma. Au tout au ma. Au tout au ma. Mazé au domaine. Ah, she has even added the wrong name to my own name. No, 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 no. No, it's not like that. That's how they speak from Congo. Very soon she will come off it. Uh huh. Oh, Zeku. You're welcome. I appreciate Sorry. your coming. Thank you very much. Uh, we are the ones that you should appreciate your coming back home. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. You're welcome. Uh, uh, please, uh, let me begin to find my way back home. Hmm? Okay. You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you very much. Bye-bye. <laughs> oh. <laughs> sabi, sabi. <laughs> Bye. Uh -huh. Everyone is happy that I'm back. Very soon, I will know how long that happiness will last. <laughs> um, our people have an adage that the horse is a very gentle animal, but the lesson men teach it has made it very violent. And if the horse could speak, it will explain in details why it became so violent that it threw down the rider. Chiomenka, report has reached this council that you have arbitrarily hacked up the fair your son charges in cultivating people's uh, land. Is it true or false? Um, Nairobi, you are very current. Very current indeed. All what you have said here is true. And why must you be so so callous when your own people like that. <laughs> I have not uh, used any Roberto or Carlos to my people, but I merely increased the price against the old one. Who do you expect to pay you such increment? Well, <laughs> those who can afford it. The highest bidder now? Yes. <laughs> Chiomeka, you must desist hmm? from implementing that increment. Only Sayas son is the most talented farmer in our land. Chiomeka, it is the gift of God. It is a gift given to him by Odessa Benigwe. And you must not use such free gifts to usurp your own people. Uh, well, uh, if, if, the, if this talent was freely given to people, then I wonder why none of your sons, all of your sons, has even one tenth of such talent. Tofia! Ayo! How dare you open that your dirty mouth to insult us? Eh? I admire the interpretation of intelligence. Your interpretation of intelligence. Omeka, swallow your pride. You are nothing but a furnish pile of sand. Yeah. Uh, 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 uh. If I did not know that you know that your father was an impotent man. I would I want to remind you that your biological father was the worst madman this land has ever produced. Shut up then. No, no. Let him talk. You have forgotten that your parents died of leprosy. Omega, talk. Calm down, calm down. Uh, be. Uh, as the manager of my son, I have a very busy schedule. 
In fact, I know right now there's a long queue of clients waiting for me so that I service them. So, um, I must go now. I say, I say, I say, if you're not so you're busy, I have a wife and I manage my wife. Did you see me leaving this meeting? This meeting is not yet over. Sit down there. Oh no, uh, let him go. Leave him. Let him go. I have made my declarations. Huh? Oh no, uh, it's not the right name for you. Oh no, Kapia. That is the right name for you. Yes. Bam. No, I will not be kind of. I would have used the stick. Put it into your manhood yes. and watch you screw your eyeballs out. Oh no, why? Oh, um, uh, the Omeka. Omeka, the manager. Okay, no. Uh, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. That is, by the way, let Omeka go with his troubles. Hmm? Uh, how about a wine? Someone sauce. Mm. Yes, I think we should go and get prepared. Hmm? The other day, how I left you, I just had to. Ah, it's okay. It's okay. Um, I understand. I know what it means to be summoned by the. Uh... Mm. Mm. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah. Meanwhile, where are you working this morning? Uh... Uh, nine one four say fan. The one at the uh, Ohiazara. Oh, oh. Uh, oh. I remember. I just wish I could help out in all the jobs. Never mind, never mind. Mm -hmm. Never mind, oh. Never mind. Ah, okay, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, you're helping me already. You'll be helping with your tender love and care. Mm -hmm. uh, and before I forget, I hope that um, urgent call by Baron Wai was for something good. Yes. Abomination. Abomination. I must find out where this is coming from. When you summon the elders to the shrine? Eh? Why? Can't you, can't you hear the drum beat of Abarini escorting the elders to the shrine? Why? Don't ask me why. Your mother should have told you that. This same abomination made our father, your grandfather, run mad. And the consequence of it is perpetual madness. Auntie, since you don't know why, let me play my music. It's okay. I, I, I will tell you that. I will tell you. I will tell you what happened. <laughs> Come and sit down. Okay. In the olden days, we used to have an... What's your problem? In the olden days, we used to have an Abaramuke. One day, the Abaramoke summons the elders to the shrine. 
that day was the cultural dance festival of our village. The elders were carried away by the music. By the time they realized themselves and went back to the shrine, the Abarawoki was dead. <laughs> mm. The wife, the wife was so angry that she cursed the land. She said, there will never be an Abarawoki in our kingdom in our land and after then later we suffered a severe oppression from another village called Udeneu kingdom since we do not have an abara descendant we decided to have an abara wine because the cause only hinders us from having an Abarawoke. And ever since then, it became a taboo. It's your ma! It became a taboo for anyone to play music on the day the Abarawoke summons the elders to the shrine. The consequences is perpetual madness. Our father, your grandfather, was a victim Antio, since you don't know how this uh tabunyo came about you just let me play my music uh history is past you know makosa is current music let me play my music yo it's your mouth it's your mouth it's your mouth Stranger, my foot! The gods has no sentiment for anyone. Yes, I know. I know. I know that she just came back from Congo. I'm so what? She just came back from Congo. No way! No way! I saw what, my own. But you can all I saw what, my own. But you can all I'll play my music one. You can't do anything. Do your worst, my own. Don't be here. Some carriers of evil have set their feet on our land. Hey! And that does not mean well for our people. But about our wine, who are these evil people? So we can fish them out and banish them from our land immediately. Abari, you have not shown me their faces. But I can feel their presence. So shall we wait till Abari shows their faces? How long will it be? Oh. We must all be at a lot. The evil I perceive is so great that our land has never witnessed before. Our land must be fortified before these evil strangers can be fetched out. In that case, mighty goddess of our land, let the fortification be done in it. It shall be done at the behest of greater Banihi. What's next? 
the daughter of the goddess Pite. Someone has trampled on the traditions of the land. The taboo of playing music. The diamond wine. Someone's the elders. She even challenged the gods to do their worst. What is the life of sacrilege? Say no more, my daughter. Awarini, the great Awarini. All this is in Kenyan. All this is war of the mother. I'm going to go. The consequence of such acts must be dished out in full portion. The bad village, I'm all around you. He's coming out today. I'll be living in the day. I'll be living in the day. Bobby, Bobby, Bobby. Ask him. I'll be living in the day. I'll be living in the day. Bobby, Bobby, Bobby. We are running to nowhere. Let her come. Do <laughs> you want? Do you want you? If you don't have to run mad, your only child. <laughs> Auntie, Yon, what you don't know is bigger than you. It is you. It is you, Isema, who don't know what is about to happen to you. Do you want to run mad, dead like your grandfather? This is the only chance. This is the only chance to save your daughter's life. Let's go. Let's run away. Let's run away. I beg you. I beg you.
Daughter, we must leave. Mother, I saw her playing music when you summoned the elders. I know, but we must leave immediately. This is the one. Is anything the matter? What I see, I cannot say until I hear more from Abariyi. We must leave now. I know that the only consequence for what she has done is pure madness. You just know, Mother Nabari, have me out of here. No! Abara, why are you bago? No, 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 Fini. Au revoir. Au revoir. Bye bye. On. Papa. Mm. Papa, I hope all is well in our land. Papa, what brought Agbara Wai out from her shrine today? There is only one thing that can bring Agbara Wai out of the shrine. Uh, yes. When someone transgresses the traditions of our land. So, Papa, tell me, who is the newest mad person in this land? The gods are silent. Agbara Wai is yet to declare madness upon the transgressor. There is great trouble in the land. What you saw concerning the transgressor and the mother. But it's my right as your successor to know this top secret. What I saw is a mystery to me that only the gods can unravel. I cannot speak. No, not now. The traditions of our land has spelled the consequences of such sacrilege. There are rules governing every law. They shall be duly punished when the gods finally speak. We didn't have to wait for the gods to speak when those that committed same sacrilege in the past. Why now? The situation is different. The situation is worse, mother. It is worse. She tell the gods of our land, mother. Is it now to nail her to death? Fair clear. They are dangerous. I believe you shall speak. And until then, you shall stay clear from them. I was consulting the Oracle before you came. Oh.
What are you doing with radio sets? Auntie, I thought we were going to the farm. Isioma, you don't need a radio set to work with in the farm. Okay, Nandi, what, what, what is wrong with you? Eh? If you are going to church, Gabriel Radio. If you are going to the market, Gabriel Radio. You going to the farm, Gabriel Radio. Then it's a busy latrin. You carry radio. Auntie, you part the problem with my radio. Part the problem with my radio. Je tell my music. Oh. I love my Makosa music. No. That Makosa will not work in this village. Isioma, go in there and drop the radio. Let's go to the farm. Ma. Mwaka. Oh, let her be. Huh? This Makosa has been part of her for over 20 years now. It's not easy to take it off from her. You let her be. Let her go with her radio. Oh, Maxi, Mama. Maxi, what? Maxi, what? It's your man. You simply don't need radio to work with in the farm. Eh? Radio is a household electronics. Not a, not a farming implement. She knows that. When will you take her for who she is? Huh? Let her be for crying out loud. I want to go back to Congo. Oh, ho! Like what Antion is doing. What? Ah, uh, ah, uh, <laughs> uh, uh, say, say, yeah. is it because of this one thing I just said now that you want to go back to Congo? Uh -huh. I want to go back to Congo. I like my music, no. Uh -huh. You take my music. Okay, see, I am sorry. Hmm? Uh -huh. You see that's your Congo music. It will work in this village. Uh -huh. It will surely work in this village. Eh? Uh -huh. Are you happy now? We. Oui. <laughs> Yeah, let's go, let's go to work. Why you here? I used my Kosa dance to gain my citizenship in Congo. Winding of my waist, when I wind it, I used it to dine with the president. You see this village? I will scatter this village with Makosa dance. Even you, you will be caught up in Makosa hold up. <laughs>